Hello friends, sir we covered very clearly about web row set. Sir not required to keep much explanation about web row set, right? Now the next type of row set is a join row set. Are you getting what is, what is that sir? Can I, can I spell out? Join row set. Sir, join row set is the child interface of web row set only. Sir, it is under web row set. Already I covered in our last diagrams, right? Next, uh, why the word join? Why the word join? Sir, I have two row sets are there. Assume the cached row set 1, cached row set 2. I want to combine, I want to join these two row sets into a single row set. Are you getting that? Can you please join data present inside two row sets into a single row set? If you want to do that, then happily we can go for what? Join row set. Everyone can able to understand, right? Sir, we can use join row set to join, sir, the data from multiple row sets into single row set based on some common column name. Sir, if you want to join, compulsory some common column must be there. With respect to that common column, we are going to do that. Okay? Sir, what is the meaning of common column? Don't worry. With the example, we are going to discuss, right? As of now, just remember only one point. To combine, to join, two row sets into a single row set happily we can go for what join row set clear the name itself indicate sir other than this the remaining properties sir join row set by default disconnected join row set by default updatable join row set by default scrollable join row set by default serializable all the remaining properties are exactly same there is no difference at all sir join row set by default scrollable you can move either forward direction or backward direction no problem at all next join row set is disconnected without having database connection happily we are allowed to access data from join row set no problem at all next join row set by default updatable if you perform any update operation to the join row set, automatically those changes by default will be reflected where, sir? Uh, can, I, can I spell out? Those changes by default will be reflected in the database. Is it clear, right? Next, uh, join row set is by default serializable. Happily, you can send the, your join row set object across the network to multiple people, no problem at all. Clear for all of you, right? Sir, that's all. This is about what the join row set normal points, right? Sir, now how you can combine how you can combine multiple row sets into a single row set that part I'm going to explain with a small example which methods we require to call all those things I will discuss right just have a look once to but just for basic idea purpose right sir in my database I have two tables are there what is the first table students second table courses first table students second second table is the courses for the students table, which data, I mean which columns are there? Student ID, which is the primary key, next student name, student address, course ID. Are you getting? Students table contain how many columns, right? Four columns. Student ID, student name, student address, course ID. Sir, what is the second one, sir? Courses. Okay. Course ID, course name and the course cost. Sir, what is, what is the course? What is the course ID? What is the course name? Course cost or price, price of the course, fees, fee, fees of the course. Like, sir, have you observed? In these two tables, is there any common column is there? Hey, respond, man. Is there any common column is there? Yes. What is that common column? Here CID is there. Here also CID is there. Based on this common column, I want to combine the two row sets into a single row set. Then happily we can go for what? Join row set. Sir, we are nearer to coding level so that you people can feel more comfortable, right? Are you able to understand up to this, right? Sir, now how to create join row set? How you can add, uh, sir, different uh, different row sets into, into a single row set? How you can able to do? I will explain. Just observe that. Sir, I have connection. Okay, I have connection is there. Now connection con is equal to driver manager dot get connection. Get connection. Observe a bit very carefully, sir. Sir, I want to connect it to MySQL database. Can you please tell what is the what is the JDBC URL, sir? JDBC colon MySQL colon local host local host double three zero six slash durga db 
are you getting this is the jdbc url next what is the username and password you know in our last examples also we covered multiple times right root root like this i have okay sir i got the connection right sir if you want to create any any row set sir can you please tell what is the way row set factory rsf is equal to row set provider dot new factory are you getting that can you can you spell out what is the way sir row set row set factory rsf is equal to row set provider row set provider provider dot new factory dot new factory sir row set row set factory is ready by using this row set factory you can able to create any type of row set no problem at all sir what i'm going to do just observe that cached cached row set r s1 cached row set r s1 is equal to cached row set r s1 is equal to sir r s f dot create create cached row set are getting create cached row set rsf done create cached row set sir i am creating cached row set object right now rs1 dot set command sir this row set this row set has to get the data of students table can you please guide what is the query sir select star from from students are you getting select a star from students rs1 dot rs1 dot set a command select a star from students now sir rs1 dot execute by using connection that's all sir do you know this cache the row set contain which information sir students information are you getting students table information this cache row set contain okay sir now I want to create another cache row set to hold the courses information. Can you please guide what is the code, sir? Yes, man. You have to tell cache row set R S two is equal to cache row set R S two is equal to R S F dot huh? R S F dot create create cache row set. Can you please create cache row set, sir? R S two dot set command. Are you getting RS2 done? Set command. Sir, which command you require to execute? Select a star from. Select a star from. Sir, this is the students. But now what I want uh, courses. Are you getting? Now I want uh, courses. Select a star from courses. RS2 dot execute a connection. RS2 dot execute a connection. Right. Sir, now take a bit very special care. The first uh, cache row set contains students information. Second uh, cache row set contains courses information. I want to combine these two row sets into into a single row set. Are you getting that? I want to combine these two row sets into a single row set. Are you getting that? How you can able to do that, sir? Create join row set. Are you getting create join row set, sir? Join row set. Join row set. R S is equal to R S is equal to row set factory already there right R S F dot R S F dot okay sir what the create ah huh? create create join row set create a join row set oh I created an empty an empty join row set now for this join row set which row sets I want to add R S one R S two R S one and R S two are joined uh, into this join row set, right? What I have to do? R S dot add row set. Are you getting? R S dot add row set of of which one I have to add? R S one, R S one, R S one. Next, uh, R S dot add row set. R S dot add row set. Which one I require to add? R S two. But make sure, sir. This R S one contain students data. R S two contain courses data. But if you want to join two row sets into a single row set, compulsory common column must be there. Are you getting right, sir? What is the common column? Can you please tell, sir? Students, student ID, student name, student address, C I D. Sir, what is the column index? Right, one, two, three, four. Okay. Here, sir, one 
टू थ्री सर कामन कॉलम इधर सीआईडी फॉर द फर्स्ट वन फर्स्ट टेबल एट व्हिच इंडेक्स इट इज देयर फोर्थ नेक्स्ट अप फॉर द सेकंड टेबल वेयर द कॉमन कॉलम इज अवेलेबल वन सो दैट कॉमन कॉलम इंडेक्स कंपलसरी वी हैव टू स्पेसिफाई फॉर द फर्स्ट वन कॉमन कॉलम इज अवेलेबल एट फोर्थ इंडेक्स फॉर द सेकंड टेबल कॉमन कॉलम इज अवेलेबल एट फर्स्ट इंडेक्स आर यू गेटिंग राइट दैट्स ऑल जॉइन रो सेट इज रेडी आर यू गेटिंग जॉइन रो सेट इज रेडी सर नाउ दिस जॉइन रो सेट कंटेन Total information are RS1 and RS2. Are you getting right? Now in the giant row set, how many columns are available? Can you please tell? How many columns are available, sir? Now if you want to observe that giant row set contain, giant row set, giant row set contain, sir, how many how many common columns are there? First one contain, I mean how many columns? First one student ID, student ID will be there, student name will be there. Next a student address will be there. Next a course ID will be there. Course ID. It is a common. That's why only one time is enough. Comma, comma course name is there. Comma course cost is there. That's all, sir. This is the these many columns are there in the join row set. If you access while R S dot next and so on, happily the data by default is going to come. Clear for all of you, sir. In our example, listen, listen, a bit carefully. In our example, I'm creating two row sets. I'm creating two row sets. I'm joining both row sets into single. Ah, uh, I mean single row set. Sir, R S is the join row set. This join row set contain R S one and R S two. For such a type of requirement, happily we can go for what join row set. Are you getting basic idea, right? If you have multiple row sets are there, I want to combine these row sets into a single row set. How you can able to do? For that we should go for join row set concept. Clear, right? Okay. So this example, if you feel comfortable, I will execute this code so that you can able to understand very easily, right? Sir, if you want, uh, sir, this join row set is the chain link interface of web row set. Sir, if you want, uh, you can publish. Share this data to the XML file. Next up, from the XML, you can able to read the data also. Such type of facility by default will be available. Don't worry, sir. Clear, sir. Let me show our material. Observe that. Join row set. It is a chain link interface of web row set. It is by default scrollable and updatable. It is disconnected and serializable. If we want to use join rows from different row sets into a single row set based on matched column, based on matched column, common column, then we should go for join row set. Already I covered right. Sir, we can add row sets to the join row set by using which which method right? Add row set method. Add row set. Sir, row set R S int. Common column index. What is the second argument, sir? Common column index. Make sure, sir. This is about what is the join row set. Everyone got basic idea about join row set, right? Okay. If you feel comfortable up to this, then I can go for a small executable program. Whatever sample code I explain, let me convert into executable code so that you people can feel more comfortable, right? Clear.